and I know them. And they follow me. And the voice of a stranger they know not. Before you make any argument, make sure that you can hear the voice of God. Because the God who said, He said, God that hears prayers. When was the last time you heard the voice of God? Jesus is the we are trying to let you know who Jesus is. Suppose you're something you said, I was about to say. Can I just talk to you for a second? Can you just talk to you? Hey, I'm just like someone uh, come up and approach me saying that you're obviously preaching and I appreciate that as well. Um, apparently you've been saying that you've been saying things that God hates homosexuals. Is this that and the other? Okay. What, what, it's on camera saying that God loves homosexuals. Everything it's on camera. What? It's on camera. What? It's on camera. What? It's on camera. Everything is on camera. Everything is recorded. Okay. What you had? What you had? You had, you had, you had me read. You had me read this. Yeah, 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 that's I, I will read it again. Yeah, that's cool. This is the word of God. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not, this, I'm not this, this was, this was sponsored by King James of this nation. King James paid for the Bible. He said, "Know ye not that the unrighteous shall not inherit the kingdom of God? Be not deceived. Neither fornicators, nor idolaters, nor adulterers, nor infeminates, nor abusers of themselves with mankind, abusers of themselves." Not thieves. You go about chasing thieves, isn't it? So if you are chasing thieves and we are also chasing unrighteous people, we are doing the same job. Unless you stop chasing thieves, then I will also stop preaching. He said, no covetous, no drunkards. If I say drunkards will not enter into the kingdom of God, somebody will say I drink because I'm offended. But this is the word of God. Go and get King James. King James who made the Bible translated. He's the one you should hold responsible, not me. No drunkards. No revilers. Oh, isn't that good? They said no thieves. No armed robbers. Do you go after thieves? When be good. So we are all doing the same job. Hallelujah. What have I said wrong? Well, I said, all I've said, all I've had someone to do, come and told me you've been saying this. So until I speak to you, I, don't, I, can't, I can't say whether we have a Listen, or not. Listen, we are doing, I'm not saying he's done police, we are doing the same job you are doing. You see, if everybody will hear the Bible, if everybody will live in line with the Bible, you will never chase a thief. There will be no drug dealers. Listen, if there are people that police in this country have to stand with, come on. I appeal to all the police in the United Kingdom. If there are people you have to stand with, you have to stand with the preachers. You have to stand with the preachers. Because we are telling people to repent. They should stop doing evil. They should stop doing bad things. We are discouraging the thieves from stealing. We are discouraging the drug addicts from start to stop. We are doing the same job as you. Except we don't run after them. Hallelujah. Jesus loves you. Preach, sir. You see, I, sir. I said God has a good plan for everybody. Why didn't they come and tell you that? God has a good plan for you. God said, for I know the plans I have for you. Preach. Listeners, God only has a good plan for you. Preach. He said, in my father's house are many mansions. Many. You tell me. In the kingdom of God, there is no sickness. In the kingdom of God, there is no hospital. We have hospital in this country. In the kingdom of God, there is no cemetery because nobody dies. Isn't this good news? We bring you good news. You will die no more. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You will not be sick anymore. You will not have coronavirus anymore. Hallelujah. Thank you, Holy Ghost. The kingdom of God is upon us. Praise the Lord. In the kingdom of God, there is no sickness. There are no thieves. There are no armed robbers. Oh, come on. If we were living in the kingdom of God, the police will have peace of mind. You will not endanger your life. And their life. Hallelujah. The Lord loves you all. Jesus is the only way. If you are listening to us, we love you. We love you so much. All we want to tell you is that God has a plan for you. For I know, you don't know God has a good plan for you, Mr. Drunkard. God has, a, God has a good plan for you. God has a good plan for you. Jeremiah 29, 11. 
If you have never read the Bible before, go and find out. Jeremiah. Jeremiah. <laughs> Hallelujah. Jeremiah, the book of Jeremiah chapter 29, verse 11. God said, for I have good plan for you. God has a better plan for you. The prime minister of this country will lock you down. But God will set you free. Glory! God set you free. If the saints have set you free, you shall be free indeed. Hallelujah. Jesus doesn't lock people down. He sets them free. Indescribable gift of God. Hallelujah. I've, I've preached before. You preached before.